Right, okay, this is episode 14, uh, just caught a Weedle, and I really need uh, a Pokemon to learn caught. That's the only reason I caught a Weedle, it's weird, I don't know. But yes, finally got it to level 7, and it's evolving into Kakuna. Uh, yeah, it does learn hard, and even though you've got Tackle now, so even if you catch one in the wild, you, st you won't get Tackle, okay? You will not get Tackle, you'll just get Hardened, which would be an absolute pain to level up. But yeah, look, looking good anyway. It's looking brilliant. So, right, I think it's time to start the epic montage. After we see this, yes, the egg is hatching. Oh, yes, the egg The egg animation looks beautiful. And guess what it is? Oh, wow, it's a Togepi. It's a freaking Togepi. That looks amazing. It really does. And are you ready now? All right, guys, get ready for this epic montage. Tune right there. Anyway, I've got a B drill 
finally, and uh, before you go back into the Ilex bar, I want you to check this guy out. He is the guy you save the uh, far fetch from, as you can see, they're getting warm right there, and he gives you the charcoal. But to be honest, you can uh, you can't really use it at the minute unless you have uh, Cyndaquil, which is obviously Kiri Lava. Um, you can't use it now because you haven't got a fire type, obviously. So you can either keep it until you get one or sell it because uh, it can get a reasonably high price. So yeah, it's pretty good. Um, now you've got the um, well, and now I've got cut because I didn't have bloody cut. Um, now I've got to teach it the Pokemon. As you can see, the bag the bag looks really good. Uh, the yellow bit is indicating what pocket you're in, so that's the TM pocket right there. The Pokeball pocket's right next to it and everything like that. Uh, you go up to the tree, press cut, and the Pokemon does it for you. No animation at the minute. I bet unless uh, you don't have it, it's just a start Pokemon, but yeah, it's pretty good. Just there is the Pokemon Shrine. Um, you can't do anything with that at the minute, but um, when you get a Pikachu coloured Pichu, take it to that shrine and they will have the spiky Pichu event. Yeah, that's brilliant. I'll show you that in the future uh, videos. Um, also, if you have Celebi, uh, it takes you back in time to Giovanni. It's like a Celebi event, it's really good. And I want, you to, I want to show you this Pokemon, which is called Oddish. Oddish will be an excellent member to your team. Um, yeah, it has poison powder, sleep powder, everything like that. It, it'll be, it'll be, it'll make an excellent uh, addition if you don't have any grass types, which is really strongly recommend catching because he's, he's pretty strong. Uh, and I've got to admit, he's pretty cute as well. Um, really cute, actually. Uh, yeah, just, obviously, he's a really good in this this part of the game anyway. Future, you'd have to evolve it to Gloom uh, and Blossom. I can't remember what it was called, but yeah, it's pretty good. And now let's see how Pidgeotto is doing. Pidgey got tangled in the badges and almost fell down. Oh god, I've got a clumsy Pokemon on my hands. Oh god. Right, so this is basically the forest. It, it's changed quite drastically and it looks really good. I mean, really good. Just here, you'll find a X attack, which will, which will be very good in the next gym. Okay, so keep that. And buy some more X attacks and everything. X defend, X, X attack, anything. Trust me, it will work out. So across here, oh god, another Pokemon battle. Yeah, there's a lot of pe there's a lot of Pokemon here. But at night time, you, I can only seem to find Oddishes. Pretty cool though. Uh, but before you continue on with the story and help that woman out, I strongly, strongly, strongly advise you to go down here and boom, ready, ready, boom, and see this weirdo hitting trees with his head. I mean, you can't really say that because I do that sometimes. I don't know about you do. I usually run round trees and go. Blah, 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 blah. Not really, but okay, maybe I do on some Saturday nights. But yeah, he he's basically wanting to teach you a Pokemon headbutt. You can teach any Pokemon you want. Uh, well, not any Pokemon, any Pokemon that can actually have it. And I give it to uh, Croconore and Pidgeotto. Um, for the obvious fact that at this point of the game, headbutt is really, really strong. It has 70 power and uh, quite a lot of speed, I can't remember what it was. So I'd switch it for uh, any moves like uh, Tackle, um, Scratch, anything like that, because uh, basically it has double the power and it will really help. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Right, so this is me trying to teach it to all my Pokemon, uh, then finally finding out that it can only do it to a uh, Togepi, which I'm going to rename. I just didn't want to rename it at the minute because I couldn't really think of a name. I was like there for like, half an hour thinking, what should I call a cute little egg Pokemon? I was, I thought, I was thinking about it, and I thought I was, I think I was going to call it Pork Scratchings. I don't know why. I'm just random like that. But yeah, this is, this is how you continue on the game. And finally, there's a new Pokemon. Well, not new, but new in my eyes. Zubat. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Right, so, <laughs> so you go here, and that woman there who you've seen, who was, um, basically, saying look after the egg and she's like ah I can't get out of the forest oh my god oh my god and she, now she's saying that she doesn't know you that's brilliant she's, she's playing hard to get isn't she so basically your Pokemon goes and tells her the way and he looks very happy about that and she's like wow you're such a smart Pokemon there's a freaking door there well kind of just walk oh my god you know some people in this game are really stupid aren't they but yeah um, Zippo, oh poor Zippo. Right, so yeah, thank you for watching this episode. Uh, some more will be up soon. 
Uh, I'm going to need some more Pokemon, I know that, so maybe uh, might get some more additions to the team. So yeah, uh, comment, rate, subscribe, and I love you all.